Good morning and welcome to a home vlog. Home vlog. Home vlog. <laughs> uh, today we got a lot of stuff to do around the house. Mm -hmm. Baby is looking adorable today. He has on his new, so these are the wonder suits we were talking about. Did we tell them about the wonder suits? I feel like we did. In the last video, I think we showed you the short sleeve one. And so these are the like knockoff brand ones. Mm -hmm. And they're really nice. Yeah, yeah. He likes them. They're a little bit big on him right now because he's still growing. Yeah. But yeah. He's a growing boy. And he's eating that hand. Mm -hmm. So let's get into it. Oh, by the way, it was real windy yesterday and one of my sails fell down over top of the pool. So I got to go reattach that. <gasps> Whoa. Yeah. Are you looking at the camera? What are you doing? He's like. What do you see? Oh, no, you're angry. He's all emotions at one time. Hello. He just really wants to eat his hand, I think. I think he might be getting hungry. Okay. There it is. My sail fell down. What I think happened was, I was using these cords here that are like plastic wrapped wire. I think the like wire slipped out of the plastic. So I don't think I had enough of a grip on the wire part with my little U-clamp there. So we're gonna have to do a little bit better job on it this time. All right, there it is, all fixed. And I added some extra little U-bolts over here just to make sure that it doesn't come undone again. Probably this one will come undone next and I'll have to add more to that one too, but that's okay. This one's a lot tighter than the other one. I'm sure it'll probably stretch out as the wind gets it, but I think they look pretty good. Is somebody happy and fed? Is that somebody happy and fed? He's oh been... no, he's so shy. <laughs> he's been talking so much. What do you have to say to us, Jackson? Tell us a story. He's shy. Oh, he was talking so much. Why aren't you telling him the story anymore? Tell us the story about the baby Jackson and the big hand in his mouth. Yeah. Tell me a story. Let me see. Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah, what else? What else happened? That's it? That's the end of the story? Was there any more that happened? Was there anything else that happened in your story? Yeah? Did it? He was talking a bunch. What else? Yeah? No. What, what happened in chapter two? Yeah. Wow. Oh, a little bit. Oh, yeah? Oh. Wow. Okay. Well, now we know. <laughs> that was a good chapter. Thank you, Jackson. Yeah. Ooh, are you doing it? Look at you. You're playing with that little toy right there. Are you doing it? Yeah, you are. Whoa, look at that. Who's our big boy? What's this thing right here? Wow. Wow. Whoa. Oh, you got Whoa. it? You want to do it? He's not quite sitting up all the way, but he's getting really strong. Yeah. You want to spin this? Wow, does that look so cool? He's like, <laughs> it's so close to me. Are you touching it? There you go. Oh, you did That it. was awesome. Nice work. You did it. You did that all on your own. All right, so I am trying to finish editing the vlog for today where we went to Hollywood Studios again. You're and the exact same configuration. I know. In the video <laughs> as I am right now. So, and then Tim is trying to put the little baby to sleep. He is very tired. He's kind of fighting it right now, but hopefully he'll go to sleep soon. I think if I lay him down, he'll fall right asleep. Look at those little baby feet. Yeah. <laughs> so I just put Jackson down for a nap, but I wanted to show you guys. We got this rug here for this area, kind of like a front seating area. I think this is going to become like Jackson's play area. So you can see we've got like his tummy time mat over there, that little seat that you guys just saw him in. And then we're going to put down this, it's just like a plain gray rug. Well, I figured something like a little bit darker and something that could get you know, stains on would be a good one for this area. Good call. Yeah, so that's why it's not like a super exciting rug, but I think it'll be good. Don't show my butt. Huh? Too late. Uh-oh. Whoa, it looks very plushy. Yeah, it seems like it's gonna be nice. Yeah, soft. Well, what the heck? There's all kinds of fuzzies on the back of this. I gotta vacuum the back of it before I put it down. Who's in charge of setting the rugs up? Target. I think it's pretty nice for just like a plain rug. Yeah. It looks nice and like soft and like plushy. Yeah. And then I think we can still put this little seat over there. Pretty nice good. work. You did it. Thank you. And there we go. Now Jackson has a little area up here for all of his stuff. 
I like that the carpet's so plushy that everything leaves marks in it. Like whenever you walk through it, it leaves marks. We could do like snow angels in it. I don't, I don't know how, to, I'm from Florida. I don't know how to do snow angels. <laughs> You're doing great, sweaty. Oh no, literally nothing. Just your butt mark. Oh, well, it was worth a try. You, you at least you tried. Yeah. I thought this would like look nicer than it does for some reason in my mind. I think it looks great. Okay. You don't think it looks nice? I don't, I just thought it would look like, no, it looks nice. Thanks. Well, you did great. <laughs> Somebody's hanging out with their best befriend in their stroller. He is the sharpest tool in the shed. He's so embarrassed by his dad who is singing Smash Mouth at him. He doesn't know what to do with himself. Are you laying on your new rug? Do you love it? What do you think? Yeah. Tell everybody how much you like your new rug. Okay. Anything else? No? You only like the color of it? Nothing else? Oh, you also like how soft it is. So you like the color and how soft your new rug is. Yeah. But that's it? Yeah. I agree. And that's it? That's all you have to say? You're talking a whole bunch for a long time, and then I pull out the camera, and you're like, no, I'm done. So are you done? No? Okay. Okay. I get it now. You just have a little bit of stage fright. Yeah. And cabbage. I don't think you know what cabbage means. Okay. So one of the things that we need to do today is we need to try to tackle the laundry room. So this is a mess of an area. Yeah. And some of the stuff's been here since we moved in. Like the guy that used to live in this house just left it. He left a lot of stuff actually. One a lot day. Of weird stuff. Well, not today, but one day we will clean out the garage. He left a lot of stuff in the garage. But um, another thing really quick is that we, I just finished editing the video. So that hopefully you guys saw that where we had a really fun day at Hollywood Studios. Yeah. And I got to ride Rise of the Resistance. Fun day. Heck but yeah. now we're going to have a not so fun day. No, this is fun. Is it? It's fun yeah, for yeah. me. It makes me feel like good to declutter stuff. We can so, go through like our 50 uh, ponchos right here. Oh yeah, this is where we keep our ponchos. <laughs> um, but my ultimate plan is to put another set of shelving, basically like this kind of shelving, like nothing too fancy. We have some more of it in the garage, but basically that up there so that we can utilize this space because this is such like a tall ceiling. Like we, we are not using any of that space up there. So that's my plan. I might even want to put one up here. Ooh. Like, because this, we could all we could use all of this space. Yeah, we could. So. Now, here's a question. Do you think, like, we, if unless we bought new washer and dryer, we couldn't do this. But do you think that it would be a better idea to, like, stack the washer and dryer and use this? Well, that was my original, um, I asked you, could we stack this? And you were like, no, because we don't have matching a matching set right now. Right. Um, we did have a matching set, but then the guy who lived here left his washer and dryer. And then our dryer died, so we used his dryer. And then we gave the washer to one of our friends who their washer was, like, malfunctioning. So we were like, we have an extra one. You can just have it. So now we have a mismatch set. Yeah, so but even day, then, the one that was here when we moved in, we couldn't stack them because it was a top load washing machine. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, one day I would like to actually stack them because what I want to do is use this space to hang like, to, so clothes can dry. Oh yeah. Like to hang clothes. Like, it's like hangers. Yeah, because that's one thing is that we don't have like a real laundry space. Right. This is just like a closet with a washer and dryer in it. So. One day I would like to do that, yes. Let's get to cleaning. Yeah. I like it when you're cleaning and you find something that makes no sense as to why it's in here. But I found our pass holder magnet with figment on it just kind of like up on this shelf over here. For no reason whatsoever. Oh, check this out. Something that I totally forgot that we had. This is a little fold-up toy box from the opening of Toy Story Land. This will work perfect for putting Jackson's toys in. Ooh, yeah, look at that. A little bit cleaner. Looking good. Also, we found this thing. Whenever we give Jackson a bath, we use these little tiny washcloths, and so we can hang them from this, and they'll dry off easier. So, uh, 
today has been a little bit like slow start to the day. <laughs> like we did some stuff around the house. We did some, like put that sale back up. We cleaned the laundry room. Um, it took me a long time to edit today's video just because of like the baby and uh, just life kind of got in the way. But the video is finally up and we haven't really done much other than that. And playing with the baby. I think it's just tough with, because of course we want to spend all of our time like doting on the baby and like, yeah, like playing with him and talking to him. And sometimes we just forget to vlog it. Yeah. And I think that's what we did today. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm sorry, but he's been very cute and he's very wiggly now. I know. It's like very he, strange. He just wants to like move all, all like, I know he's not like walking and I know that the step reflex is just that that's all it is. It's just a reflex, but it feels to me like he wants to be moving. Like he yeah. wants to be walking or crawling or just like mobile. You he know? wants to be out exploring the world. Yeah. And he can't really do that yet. <laughs> so. No. He almost rolled over today from his stomach to his back. That's something that like I hope that he does soon. I would like for him because I think he's I think the milestone is supposed to happen like near three months. Rolling over? Yeah. Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, is that not I don't, just the stuff that I've been reading. So I do hope that he does it soon. But um, if he doesn't, that's OK, too. Like, it's totally fine. But I just I don't know. I would like to see him roll over. Is there something that we're supposed to be doing to like make him roll over? I think sooner? just tummy time. Like we have to make sure that we're doing tummy time. You well, know? I do tummy time with him every day. Yeah. You okay, buddy? You know, he's like, I'm upset. Oh no. But now I have to cook some dinner. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have some kielbasa and some sweet potatoes and some salad. And some sauerkraut. Oh yeah, and some sauerkraut and mustard. This is gonna be good. It's gonna be delish. Oh no, are you so tired? Oh, also the weather has been so nice today, so. Um, I think it's good grilling weather. Yeah, except for tomorrow it's supposed to get cold. But I think that'll be nice. Real cold. Well, so tomorrow we're actually going to be doing some volunteer work outside. And I am excited. Well, buddy, you just ate so much food. Why are you eating my hand? <laughs> I, he wants to. I think he's going through a growth spurt. And so I think he's hungry like all the time this week I th me too kid me too. <laughs> but so we're gonna be doing some volunteer work outside so i'm happy that it's gonna be cooler <laughs> he's happy oh, no. too okay Is i gotta he... i'm gonna feed him all right grill has officially been cranked up also i have a cistern i don't really know why we have a cistern the guy that we bought the house from put it in uh, I guess it'll be good if there's like a hurricane. We'll let it fill up with the rainwater and then we can use that to flush toilets and stuff. But kind of strange. I've never seen a cistern at anybody else's house ever. Look at you momming it up. It's very hard. I'm just trying to eat my salad. I'm starving. I'm trying to keep him calm. He's like not having it. He's drooling everywhere. He needs to go to sleep. It's so funny because he always does this thing where he's like, I need to go to sleep. And we're like, seriously, your bedtime is in like an hour and 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. Just like, it's not enough time for you to have a nap and go to bed. We've been like timing his naps wrong. Yeah. Well, we just go off of when he's tired. Mm -hmm. But let's go look at the sunset. Okay. Oh yeah, that looks awesome. Look at how beautiful that sunset is. See? This is the kind of stuff that makes me like, I don't care that today was a little bit hard because this is where we live and this is the kind of view that we have. Heck yeah. I'll tell you what, grilling on a cooler night like this is awesome just for the simple fact that you don't have to open the door to go outside. The door's already open, like to the screen door and you just like walk out and you're like, all right, flip them over some sausages mm -hmm. and then come back inside. Nice. Yeah. How, you guys want to see the sausages? What was the temperature outside? Uh, 69. Nice. Yeah, let's go see these sausages. Ooh, yeah, look at how good those look. Those look so good. Yeah, they do. Wow. They need to be flipped over though, so oh. we gotta flip them. Okay, so we finally finished dinner, and we have sweet potato and two kielbasas with sauerkraut, and the baby is asleep. <laughs> so... This is just kind of how our day has been. He wasn't supposed to fall asleep right now. He's supposed to get a bath and then go to sleep at eight. Well, I'm thinking he will probably wake up when you like move after you eat. And so then we can just give him a bath really quick and then he'll go right to sleep. What do you think? Yeah, I think so. Because he's only like sort of asleep. 
Like his little hands are still like Hi. active. There he goes. Hello. See? Back <laughs> asleep. But how's your dinner? <clears throat> sweet potatoes good. I haven't had the the sausages yet. Yeah, I love sweet potatoes. Delicious. You look so cute. Dad of the year. Now we finally finished dinner and somebody's getting a bath. Getting a bath. This little baby. Look at this little baby eating his hand. He loves the bath, huh? Look, he's eating those soapy hands. Oh no, buddy. Let's rinse those hands off. Yeah. There you go. Oh no, are you pooping? No. He's making a poop face. So this has nothing to do with anything that happened today. What? But we watched Hot Ones, the Hot Ones with Pete Davidson. Pete Davidson is one of my favorite comedians. I think he's hysterical. Mm -hmm. And I like watching everything that he does because it's interesting to me. Mm -hmm. But he did Hot Ones. And every time that I watch Hot Ones, I'm like, hmm, I kind of want to try some of these hot sauces. And then the other day, I had some Nashville hot chicken. And I was sweating like crazy. And I got mild. And I'm like, okay. after that, I'm just like, why did it, why do I want to try these hot sauces? I don't want to try them. I used to be able to eat hot sauce like it was nothing. Yeah. But now, no. Because I like, I went off hot sauce for a while. <laughs> I like how you're like, I'm clean and sober from hot sauce. Yeah. Because I, you guys, I don't know if you guys remember, but there was a point in the videos where one of my coworkers had given me some like Carolina Reaper hot sauce mm -hmm. or whatever it was. Trinidad scorpion pepper hot sauce. Yeah. And I was just like taking spoonfuls of it and it would cause me to have the hiccups right away and I would just start sweating profusely, but I could handle it. Right. I don't think I could do that anymore. No, I don't think so. I think those videos are like 10 years old. So yeah. that's like a different time in your life. It's true. We're not like in our 20s anymore. We can't just eat spoonfuls of hot sauce. <laughs> Let's try it right no. now. Right before bed. I'm okay. Yeah. You can try it. I'll film no. you. No. <laughs> the only hot sauce that we have is like Taco Bell mild sauce, it's and I'll true. do it. <laughs> I'll do it. Yeah, I'll do, I'll I'll do, do a it. spoonful of Taco Bell mild <laughs> sauce. Don't don't tempt me. Um, so all in all, I think that today was a fantastic day. It, today was a really good day, and I'm happy that we got to spend just like so much time with Jackson, and he was talking so much, and ta I say talking, he was making a lot of like baby noises, um, and he was just very cute today. But then he did not want to go to sleep. No. Well, he fell asleep while I was eating. And then he woke up to get a bath. Mm -hmm. And then after the bath, he's just like, I'm not having it. <laughs> no, he wanted to stay awake all night. Like, he yeah. was like, I'm never going to sleep. Um, but then I fed him and he fell asleep. So that was good. But uh, I don't know what it is about, like, recently he's been having a hard time going to sleep. I think maybe it's because, like, the lighting outside is changing because mm. it's no longer winter anymore. Maybe. And so his nap times are like fluctuating throughout the day. That could be it. His nap times are definitely fluctuating. But he's asleep now and he hopefully will sleep for a while because yesterday they, he slept for nine hours. Nine hours. I could not believe it. Yeah. He went to sleep at like 8.30 mm -hmm. and he woke up at 5.30. So nuts. I think that's, so. I think that's right. Oh. However long it was, it was a long time. And yeah. we got like some good sleep, which was nice. But I think we are going to go to bed. Oh, and I did want to say that the laundry room. So I know we were showing you guys how we were like going to work on the laundry room. We're not finished. We're not done with no, it. No, 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 no. Yeah. So um, I think we got a good start. But I would like to put up some more shelving in that room mm -hmm. and do some more organizing. Maybe get some like fabric boxes or something, you know, to make it like look nicer. Mm -hmm. Are you yawning again? Yeah. Okay. We have you to ever go tried to, to yawn with your mouth closed? <laughs> you look crazy. You're like. You're like. <laughs> it's really hard to do. Yeah. Um, okay. So we're going to go to bed. And thank you guys for hanging out with us at home today. Yeah. So with that being said, we are off. We'll see you guys tomorrow. And, and now, now it's time, time to, to pay, pay the, the price. price.